board work session. All members present. 10 a.m. Okay, we have uh, some read on resolutions uh, that are important. One, uh, an employee in the um, environmental department, son got very ill and she has to stay home. So there's a permission to transfer vacation time from others to this person. Is that okay to read on? Uh, we have to read on the, the, the granting of a, uh, of a contract to Linda's Lovely Ice Cream, or Lovely Linda's Ice Cream at the um, concession sales at Long Beach. Uh, it's a read on. Yeah, I'd like to talk about that in executive session. Okay. And seasonal appointments for uh, parks employees. Um, that, that's that one. Um, okay. Uh, as you all know that the uh, Department of Environmental Conservation is removing tires from the ISO site, um, and they have a contractor to do that. And because they want exact uh, numbers of what gets removed, they've made a request uh, for their trucks to go over our scales at the MSF. It's right nearby the ISO property. Um, Russell Barnett indicates we ought to allow them to do that um, so the quicker they can get these tires out of there, the better for all of us. And there would be a cost, and they're trying to calculate the cost of uh, each truck going over the scale. It will be 10 to 12 uh, trips a day. The, um, Mr. Gorecki says there's no problem with that, and of course, included in the cost per um, weighing each truck, it would uh, take into consent uh, the employees and the wear and tear on the facility. So I just need to get permission to tell them that would be okay to do from the board. Sounds good. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'll take care of that. <clears throat> we have two, at least two um, um, litigation matters. Correct, and what else do we have here? Um, I know there's something else. Oh, the site plans. Do we want to go over site plans now? Sure. Keep it quick. Um, there's two applications for the board's consideration this afternoon. In the board of site plan review. The first is a site plan for Smithtown Ford. Um, the existing site is 6.3 acres. The property to the uh, east is another 5.6 acres. They're expanding it for uh, display. Um, it'll also clean up the frontage, uh, curbing, paving, lighting. It's uh, pretty straightforward. The seeker is on for this afternoon. Uh, they were recommending approval with three conditions. The applicant is in agreement and is already signed off. Is that next to uh, Senior Center? Close senior is, Center yeah, is up here. Way, right, right. Montclair. Okay. Smithtown Concrete. The next application is called Burger Station. Many people know this uh, building. It's at the uh, intersection of Jericho Turnpike and Vets Highway. It's been a derelict structure for probably 20 years. It's actually listed on the, uh, the town's list from 2011, the 22 uh, most derelict properties. Um, this is uh, what they plan on doing with the facade of the building. Where was that again? Yeah, tell me where that is. This is uh, right at the intersection of Vets Highway and uh, Jericho Turnpike, right by the Cannon. There's a car wash there, isn't there? Across the street, and there's a brand new Taco Bell right it's next to Taco this. Bell, yeah. Right adjacent to Taco Bell. So it's South across East the street corner. from the car wash. Yes. By the Macy's. And then there's a bank, uh, Bank of America, next to this, to the south. It's right at the splits, the uh, gateway to the town coming from Huntington. Okay. So it'll be a huge improvement for the site. Several variances from the Board of Zoning Appeals. And. Uh, the, uh, the secret was done at the last uh, town board meeting. The applicant is in agreement with the conditions. We got a few minor DOT uh, issues to work out. Mm -hmm. The DOT does yeah, not that's object. horrible. They're taking three curb cuts and closing it off to one. Is this the uh, is this the old uh, precision precision tune? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's been a thorn. And it's in going the town to be a side. burger. 
hamburger place? Yeah, we, we believe it's going to be similar to like the American Roadside Burger oh, okay. here on Main Street. Um, the only other matter I just wanted to bring to the board's attention, I spoke to the architect this morning, Carmen <coughs> Grasso. Okay. He insists that Reliable Tree will be submitted by the end of this afternoon. Here we got the uh, site email. Emails. Yeah. The uh, and deadline then he has 30 is Friday. Days to start his uh, from approval, correct? 30 days from the approval of the site plan to begin the buffering and the planning. Right. Okay. That's all, all I have for the board. When, when you do a site plan, does that ha have all the traffic studies already been done before that, before it comes to us? If e everything gets done. Not, it's not always requested. Mm -hmm. Just want to see Usually. how it works. Any questions? No. Okay. Thanks, Thank you. Anybody else have anything before we go into executive session? No. I'd like to ask Matt, uh, have you heard anything at all from the appraiser? Yes. On that property up in Kings Park? <clears throat> Actually, I just received it this morning, and the appraisal came back at 230000 Which is below the number that they Yes. It was last listed at 269. And what did they want? 230. Well, they want 270, I think. Is that what they the and the appraisal's 230. Yes. Yeah. Can I ask Frank? Frank, this um, this county initiative on this uh, that we it looks like they may be funding for us. Yes. Would wouldn't that include? Couldn't that be inclusive in that? I know it's downtown business for Kings Park and Smithtown, but couldn't that be part of the, their review? And when you say the review, you're talking about whether or not uh, we're going to have municipal parking there. Is that what you're talking? Correct. Yeah, I mean that's well, certainly one of the elements of. Okay. Uh, I mean, we could we could include that in in the uh, the, the report that they're going to issue us. That's today. correct. Okay. I would mention, though, however, we already, uh, they'll be in the, the land use plan of the comprehensive plan will be coming out in about seven or eight weeks. And it will contain an analysis of uh, parking um, demand on a block by block basis and whether or not it's being met. So okay. you'll be able to. Uh, so that'll be exclusive in that. Yeah. And mm -hmm. then, Matt, you're going to, um, when you have the time, you're going you're to talk to the MTA, right? yourself and Mitch um, referencing the possibility of taking a look at the parking equation that's in that contract yes because we have I mean it's taken up that whole lots taken up which we realized recently by commuters um, that would be an opportunity to have some downtown business parking however would have to make amend that agreement <coughs> so see what they say about that yes okay thank you thanks Frank mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay I'll move to go into executive session again all in favor? Uh, yes. Yes. Are you here? Yeah, I'm not going to I move to close the meeting. Second. All Aye. in favor? Aye. 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 Oops.